All right, so this is on shape, um, designing the deck, doing, uh, well, designing a skateboard, sorry. And we're doing design a deck and designing the truck. So we're doing 2.1 and 2.2. You're going to, um, from starting from zero, we're gonna have the sketch. We're gonna put in the top plane You can click in to get the normal view. We're going to add a center point rectangle. Pull it out. Then I'm going to add a center point circle. You want to make sure it constrains, so you need this orange box to pop up there, and you need it to pop up and highlight this line that's a part of the rectangle. <clears throat> then we are going to give it dimensions. is nine, zoom out a little bit, pan it. Then we're going to give this long part, and pull it around here to be 31. All right, so we are done with that sketch. I believe, up, up, up. All right, check mark. Now we're going to select that and then we're going to extrude it to 10 millimeters. All right. Now we're going to um, make the holes. We're going to open up Sketch again going to be on the face of extrude one. We're using this rectangle again, this center point rectangle. We're going to put it here. We're going to give it dimensions. Let me see where my dimension is. All right. So our height is 1.685. And our width, 2.125. And then um, from here to here, it's eight. All right. Then we are going to use our mirror tool Select the mirror line. We want the mirror, the mirror line right in the middle of our skateboard. Select entities to be mirrored. One, two, three, four. And now we have to add our holes. I'm going to search holes. Oh, let me press that first and then hole. So we are going to select one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we want our settings here to say countersink through ANSI clearance number 10 free. We want 0 0.201, 0 0.411 at 82 degrees. And again, this is given to you in the lesson. Next, we are going to just kind of see the side. It's not as smooth as we would like, so we're going to use the fillet tool. We're going to select the top and bottom part. We get that a nice little smooth. We're going to Right click, edit, make sure your fillet radius is 0.125. Mine automatically did it. Just double check that yours is where it needs to be. Um, last portion of 
We're going to right click, edit appearance. We're going to change the color to orange. That's not a very pretty orange. And then we are going to also change the material, assign material. We want maple hard. And then last step, they wanted you to see the mass. And we get the mass is 2.663 pounds volume. And that is because we assigned it a material. All right, so that is 2.1.